Hello everyone, welcome to RSC Healthcare's Time Entry Tutorial. Today, we will show you how to download the ADP Workforce Now app and how to enter your time on a mobile device. First, if you have an iPhone, click the App Store. If you have an Android, click the Play Store. You will then select Search, go to the search bar, and type in ADP. Select Search, and you will see the first option is the ADP Mobile Solutions app. You will select Download. Once it's done downloading, select Open. You will then be taken to the login screen. Please keep in mind that you need to have an ADP Workforce Now account. If you do not have an ADP Workforce Now account, please reach out to our payroll department. Please enter your user ID, then select Next. You will then enter your password. Select Login, and you will be directed to the ADP dashboard. From there, you will see the menu option in the top left-hand corner where there's three bars. Then you will select Myself, then select Clock. You will then see the current time and date. Once you're ready to clock in for your shift for the day, select Start Work. Then you will see that your time has started. Then you can proceed to close out the application and continue your work. Once you're ready to clock out for your break, you will then proceed to the ADP app. You will then be invited to log in again. You will enter your username and your password. Select login. You will then be directed to the dashboard again. Select the menu, myself, and clock. Then you will select end work. Once you select end work, then you will proceed to go on your break. Once you're back from your break, you will then have the option to click Start Work again. You will select Start Work and allow the time to continue until you're ready to clock out for the day. You will then proceed once you're ready to clock out and finish your shift, you will select End Work. Once you select End Work, then you will have your time automatically saved. The time card will then automatically be sent to your supervisor to review and then will proceed for approval. If you have any questions, please contact our payroll department or your supervisor.